Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, and welcome to my bed update. My bedroom has the most heinous lighting, and until my filming equipment comes for the cabin, we will remain in our cozy corner. Yay! So today in this video, I wanted to talk all about you guys about my hacks to have a really good morning. I get asked all the time how I'm such a morning person, how to become a morning person, and everything like that. And don't you worry, there's a morning routine coming. But in this video, we're gonna talk about my hacks to having a good morning and why I like my morning routine so much. So we're gonna give you guys a bit of a room tour of my room here at the cabin. So many of you guys have asked to see it and it's not totally completely done, but let's be real. I'm one of those people who I probably will never be complete. I love home decor so much. How did I get black on my fingers? Right into the video because we all got things to do. We all got people to see other videos to watch, I feel you. But first, I wanna say thank you to Brooklyn Inn for sponsoring this video. I am obsessed with Brooklyn Inn. We will get into that. I've shared it in vlogs before, and y'all have wanted to hear more about them, and I've just been like preaching about them, and now we actually do want to sponsor videos. So let's live our life, let's get into the morning hacks, and then we'll get into the morning, no, the room tour. My first morning hack is actually a website that I found where they send you an email every morning with a morning mantra. And I know you're thinking, Marissa, you're so obsessed with morning mantras, calm the hell down. If you guys don't know, I post morning mantras all the time on Twitter, on Instagram, and this website spoke to me so much. And here's why I'm so obsessed with it. How many times have you heard people say like, don't check your phone first thing in the morning? How many times have I said, don't check your phone first thing in the morning? But how often do we like still check our phones the first thing in the morning? I have to hang up, oh my God, what's going on? Be real, we're gonna check our phone in the morning. It just happens, it's a habit. We're millennials, we're attached to our phones, it happens. So you might as well make the most of the time that you're on that phone. They send you an email every morning and it is a morning mantra. Why am I, why I am obsessed with this morning mantra email is, because I then take that mantra and that is what I meditate with. I then take that mantra and that is my journal prompt. It just seriously puts me on the best like foot of my day and I know that like can sound so silly but if you wake up in a bad mood, if you wake up and you're having just very negative energy, if you had a fight the night before with like a friend or your boyfriend or you wake up like just feeling really down, like reading this mantra totally shifts your energy and think about how amazing it would be if more people were reading these mantras and shifting their mindset like it could be amazing. So, so phenomenal. I'll link it down below. It's like three bucks a month, so cheaper than your coffee. And I really like that I pay for the email because then, honestly, it motivates me to do it. So I, I'm just so in love with it. Oh, it's really been helping me. And I've had mantra books, I've had mantra apps, and I will say the email, I do it quicker just because I'm already in my email in the morning. I go straight to it, I sit there, I read it, it's super cute. I actually screenshotted this morning's to show you guys. It says, I now invite the highest version of all areas of my life. Like, look how cute that is, obsessed. Speaking of starting your day on the right foot, the next thing I do, as I mentioned, is I journal. I love journaling. I said in one of my last videos that very soon I will be creating a video showing you guys how I journal and how I use my journal, but one of the ways that I use my journal is I take that mantra and I write down goals and like perfect example. So this said, I now invite the highest version of all areas of my life. In my journal today, I wrote down what that looked like and how it made me feel. What the highest version of things in my life looked like. My highest relationships, my highest career goals, my highest friendships, the highest like version of me. I wrote down what those look like to me, how they made me feel. And then I also did for every one, I listed a step of what I will do to get closer to that highest version of everything. Like these are all things that just put me in the best mood and journaling also like helps you write out your goals every morning and ugh, I'm so obsessed with journaling. I'm so obsessed with these mantras and it just like really motivates me and gets me going. Also, I only journal for about five minutes honestly. It goes very, very quick. So I don't want you guys to think that these hacks that I'm talking about are going to be some long drawn out morning thing. We got things to do. My next hack is kind of more of your space and where you're at. And so a lot of times when people wake up in the morning, they could have not slept that well, or they just don't like their room that much. They don't like their bedding that much. And it's just like you wake up in a funky space. As I have gotten older, I have learned to appreciate my bedding, my space, where I'm at. And as we know, I am obsessed 
with my Brooklyn and sheets. Let me tell you, there is nothing nicer than nice sheets, luxury sheets. For affordable, like I'm also bougie on a budget, so don't get it twisted. Well, Brooklinen is the leading e-commerce site for bedding. They're phenomenal. Everything is so, so beautiful. High quality bundles are phenomenal. So I have the Lux bundle and I will insert some clips now of when I actually got my Brooklinen bedding the first time months ago. And I have now replaced all my bedding with Brooklinen at my cabin. This is my bedroom at the cabin. It's extremely bare, extremely... I have a cute bed, that's about it. But you know what my bed does not have? Nice bedding. And you know one of the best ways to first get over a breakup, second off, well I guess like do for yourself during a breakup and really just like a very, very good self-care tip that I've learned since becoming a real adult, nice bedding. Nice, nice bedding. I used to buy like literally whatever sheets, whatever bedding from Home Goods or like from Target or anything. And then I discovered <sighs> nice sheets. And then I discovered like nice sheets aren't like all 400, 500 like. <sighs> so as I talked about in a few of my last videos, I keep talking about this bedding and these sheets that I've gotten and I've never even shown them, but I discovered Brooklinen and they are sponsoring this video. So thank you Brooklinen for helping me get over my breakup, get my life back together and get my room in order. So Brooklinen is amazing. They have cut out the middleman. They are high quality luxury sheets for such an affordable price for luxury linen. And they also have like amazing candles. Side note, like I feel like those aren't promoted enough. They have amazing candles. So. I picked up the Lux Core set, I believe. I will correct that if I'm wrong. Two pillows. I chose mid plush pillows and I got the down alternative, which is amazing that they offer a down alternative so none of the little animals are getting hurt. Um, I got the mid plush and then I got the all season comforter also in down alternative. 100% cotton satin show hypoallergenic, full queen, cause this is a queen. Um, so, and then I also got the sheets and I got just plain, plain white. My vision for this bedroom is pretty much all neutral. I so I got my all white Brooklyn and stuff. And also like these sheets are soft as hell. Um, don't tell Brooklyn and yet, but I might've used my own code already to buy more sheets for my other bedroom in Pleasanton. Uh, cause I got a sheet problem and I really like nice sheets. These are literally so soft and just like, they feel like hotel sheets, but even better. Like I didn't know that was possible, but it does. And they're like the most perfect white color and it's going to brighten the room up and everything is so soft. I'm excited. It also came with a comforter cover. Okay. We have our pillow cases. So let's start with that. I love that they come in these nice little cases because every time that I would move, I would have to put my pillows in trash bags so they didn't get like destroyed. So yay about that. Nothing gets me going like a fresh pillow. This is iconic. Do you ever like go to a guy's house or like whatever, a friend's house, and um, you look at their pillows and you're like, you for sure have had that since 1997. You need to throw that away. You nasty. A friend out with my code, uh, code lace, get $20 off your order and free shipping. Also, side note, when I like Googled the Brooklyn Inn sheets and like the company itself when I first started looking into this, they literally have over 12,000 reviews and pretty much everyone has named them the best linen company. So like when you're thriving and like you're an e-commerce store crushing the game, Brooklyn and his goals. Every time I look out of the corner of my eye, I think that wall hanging is someone here to kill me. <sighs> I love being on the edge of my seat in day-to-day -day life. This is my 
my duvet cover. So it comes with your obviously fitted sheet, normal sheet, and duvet cover, which I think is amazing. Y'all, this like literally feels like, I don't, I feel like this sounds bad, but like cold butter velvet. Like it's cooling, it's going to keep you not hot. I hate waking up hot. I don't live that life. I'm not about that. Uh-uh. Um, and it's just like, oh, it's just like silky feeling and like buttery. I don't know how to explain it. I don't know how to explain it. I'm sorry, if we needed another selling point, there's short side and long side labels for the fitted sheet. Also, got the duvet comforter on. Okay, you guys, super embarrassing. Um, I finished putting this on and I started crying because as we know, I would come to the cabin with someone and it was always really special to me. And the fresh start is very exciting. So again, a huge thank you to Brooklinen for helping me do this. And this is literally just like an amazing quality. And I love companies that really are just like taking out the middleman and trying to create an amazing product. Um, a amazing luxury product that more people can afford so I'm so excited and I actually didn't put any of the like throw blankets or the decor pillows on luxury but super affordable and I will say I love waking up with these sheets I love being in my bed you feel in a better mood when you take care of yourself you feel it when you take care of your energy in your space you feel it and their two most popular bundles are under $200 and I mean like that's your whole bedding right there and like you're gonna have friends come over, you're gonna have a man come over, and they're gonna be like, whoa, she's serious. This is a lady. <laughs> Highly suggest you guys check out the link down below. Get some Brooklyn and sheets. It's so important with waking up in a good mood, you look around, look around in your room, your space. What does your space look like? Is your bed comfortable? Are your sheets comfortable? Do you feel like a princess and like the goddess that you are? I love companies that care about the product and have core values about their products and about the company. So love Brooklyn and support them 100%. Again, check out the link down below. My next morning hack is I again fuel my brain. I fuel my mind. I feed my mind. So I take five to ten minutes and I read a book. The book that I'm reading right now is called Creating Money. I've been posting it all over social media. I talked about it in my favorites video and I'm over halfway through I freaking love it so five to ten minutes I normally read a chapter and then there's a little workbook at the very end of each chapter and it asks you questions you fill them out I feel so inspired I feel motivated so I highly highly suggest reading five ten minutes if even if it's on your iPhone if you like the books on your iPhone read the books on your iPhone perfect get your mind going, get your mind fueled. And if you're someone who you're like, Marissa, I'm not a morning person. If I stay in bed, if I read in bed, I will fall asleep. Girl, get up, go to the couch, lay on the other side of your bed, sit up in your bed. I sit up in my bed sometimes, or when I'm at the cabin, I head to my favorite coffee shop. It just depends on where I'm at, you know? My last hack for having a good morning is to prep ahead. And this is again for all my people who have a very hard time waking up in the morning. So prep ahead. The night before, write your to-do list that night. So you go to bed with just an empty head and you're not stressing and you're like, tomorrow is a new day. I'm going to conquer everything then. If you are a coffee person, prep everything. That way you just go downstairs or go into your kitchen and simply make your coffee, have your beautiful little tonic, hot lemon water. Do that. Or if you're a smoothie person in the morning, definitely put everything in your blender. I personally use a Nutribullet, so it's super easy. It's just like a cup. I throw everything in my my um, Nutribullet and I just throw my Nutribullet in the freezer and then in the morning I just pour the liquid in it, pop it on there, boom. Those are normally the days I'm not intermittent fasting though, I'm not gonna lie. I've been on the intermittent fasting train recently and I'm super into it. So now we're at the end of the video where I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek into my actual room because like I said, the space is very important. I like my room very plain, I will say. I kept my room here super plain, so. Let's show you. You walk in and this is my room. So in the corner, I have a little basket of my blankets. I have this super cute little fake candle. I have my um, oil diffuser. I have a little candle holder so it just illuminates the room. I need to replace these lamps. I really wanna get selenite lamps. These are my beautiful Brooklyn and sheets. I ended up just throwing on this little neutral decor pillow from, I don't know, like Target or something. 
Um, this is my plant I just keep in the corner to raise the energy in the room and purify the air. I love that little basket. And then this is my most important side table, which has my to-do list, my books, my journal, same little thing on this side, a nice fake plant, and a crystal. So, love, love my bedding. Also, when my friends come and stay with me, they're obsessed with this bedding. So, my pillows are Brooklinen, the duvet is Brooklinen, again, um, down alternative, which is very, very important. So, Brooklinen not only has sheets, but they also have everything for your bed. And again, the candles. Don't underestimate the candles. The candles smell very great. So, I love you guys so much. Make sure to check out everything I talked about down below. I will list Brooklinen. I will have a link to check out the Morning Mantra email. And I love you guys so much. Thank you for your support. And um, let me know what you guys want to see next. Love you guys.